Sure, YouTube is Disphonic here and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to share with you guys a very cool and amazing feature that allows you to extract vocals from a song. The name of the tool is lalal.ai, which is a web-based vocal extraction tool. It extracts vocals and instrumentals from any audio. So this will be a very useful feature if you are a DJ, a sound producer, or any creative professional. If you want to get your hands on that very dope instrumental or that very cool and soothing vocal. So let me show you how you can do this. All you have to do is click the link under the description and it's going to lead you to the website that will be using so after clicking the link you land onto a web page that looks like this um, as you can see it's lalal.ai and the description reads extract vocal and instrumental tracks from any audio so what you have to do is very simple you choose a file or drag and drop it over here and then you select between the three processing levels there's mild normal and aggressive so it is best to try all of the three processing levels so in order to test the extraction tool and see how effective it works let's use this audio that has um vocals on it maybe i am too straightforward and you can tell it's crossing the line Crossing the line So let's drag and drop the audio onto the tool And then it's going to upload the audio And then it's going to begin processing the audio So once processing is done, it gives you two previews One is the vocal and the other one is the instrumental So it gives you a chance to listen to the previews and then once you're satisfied you can go ahead to process the entire track and download the two audio files so let's play the vocal preview maybe i am too straightful person and you can tell it's crossing the line and then i think i'm satisfied with the vocal preview let's go ahead with the instrumental preview Now that I'm satisfied with both the vocal and instrumental preview, I can go ahead and click process the entire track. So now it's preparing the two files, which is the instrumentals and the vocals. Now the entire audio has been fully processed and then it says click um, download next to the files to download the separated stems. The download links were also sent to your email address. And then you can just click download here so that you can download the vocal. And then you can also download the full instrumental. But then remember, I had selected the normal processing level and we still have two other different processing levels, which is mild and aggressive. So let me re-upload the audio using a mild processing level and then do the same using aggressive. And then we can just have a comparison of the three different processing levels. So I've loaded the three results from the three different processing levels onto my FL Studio so that we can clearly see the WAV files and see what's um, happening with the audio files that we got. So as you can see, I have two stems from the mild processing level, two stems from the normal, and two stems from the aggressive. And then this one over here is the instrumental of the mild, vocal of the mild, instrumental of the normal, instrument uh, a vocal of the normal and then we have the instrumental and then the vocal of the aggressive so let's start with the instrumental audio of the mild processing level and then we'll go to the next stem and then we'll compare the three different um, processing levels and then see which one works best for our audio <music> All right, let's go to the vocal of the mild processing level. Maybe I am too straightful person and you can tell it's crossing the line. Pardon me, pardon me. Okay, let's go to the normal processing level. Let's start with the instrumental. And then 
let's go to the vocal only. Maybe I am too stray for person and you. Let me go to this section where the vocal is a bit too loud. I gotta say before you take my words so deep up. And then let's go to the aggressive. Let me play the beat. As you can hear at this part, I think it was the climax of the beat. The, the vocal was high and loud and also there were a lot of guitars and bass lines over there. Let me go to the vocal of the aggressive processing level. I gotta say before you take my words so deep up. I think in this case there's a very slight difference between the three processing levels. Um, I think it's due to the fact that the audio we are working with has a very clean and clear um, vocal. So you can easily distinguish between the vocal and the instrumental of the track. So the more clean your song is, the more it's going to be easier for the um, AI technology to separate your instrumental from your from your vocal. So you can try all of the three different um, processing levels on whichever audio and then you can pick which one works best for you. But I feel like in this case, the aggressive does it for me, especially on this um, section over here where the vocal is loud. Let me just play it again. I gotta say before you take my words so deep. I think it sounds very much cleaner and very pure. This is the beat. As you can see, it's a very clean uh, bass line and also there are some nice percussions playing over there. So that's how effective the tool works. I feel like it is very effective and it takes a few seconds and it's very easy to use. They also have a few packages. There's a free package for those who just want to try out the tool. Uh, it's three input tracks and 10 total, um, 10 minutes total. And then there's also the light package, which is 10 input tracks or 90 minutes total at 10 US dollars. This is for music lovers. And there's a professional package. Uh, it's 30 input tracks or 500 minutes total. This is for professional content creators. And then they also have a special package for those who want to work with a lot of audios. And uh, I think this one you can negotiate for those who work with high data volumes. This is a custom high volume package. So that's the tool guys. I feel like it is very quick and easy to use. It is budget friendly and it takes a few seconds to process your audio. Obviously, it also depends on your network coverage. So if you like the video, please go check them out. Click the link under the description. And yeah, likewise, if you're new here, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. Cheers.